Dave Souza, Waterford High School AD. 25 years ago, Dave and I met at UConn basketball camp, and I was his assistant coach at Bacon Academy. Uh, Dave, you have announced this year is your last year here as athletic director at Waterford. Um, how did you know the time was right? I've had a good run. You know, I, I was a head coach here for 10 years in football. I, I did 20 years at Bacon. I did 12 here. That's a good, good long time to be involved with kids and coaching and so forth. Right. Now talk about the run, Dave. You've seen a lot of special athletes, a lot of special kids. How special was it, you know, coaching your son maybe on the football field and seeing him grow and mature as a young man? The, uh, I, I was fortunate. You know, I, I started coaching in football here, head coach. And then in my last four years, my oldest son came through, and we had a great bond. We had a great year. We were undefeated that senior year, and uh, it was a nice way for me to end football. <laughs> yeah. So, so maybe this basketball team will keep it going. What, what, what made it special, Dave, for all those years? You know, coaching, athletic director, um, what made it so special for you personally? Well, you know, it's very seldom can you actually get to coach your son yes. at, at a high level. Right. You know, most people, they do it in youth and that kind of stuff. But I got to come every day and, and see my son and work with him and make him better and work his friends. He had 18 of his friends on that team. Yeah, yeah. So I knew them all. I knew them since they were little kids. How about some of the kids that have passed through here, you know, and some of the coaches along the way? I'm, I'm sure you've got a lot of great things to say about a lot of people. I've, I've been fortunate. You know, we've been very successful here at Waterford. And the reason we've had tremendous athletes, of course, and great parents, but we've had great coaches. Yeah. They do a super job day in and day out. They work hard, and we're competitive. If you look at our banners up here, we, we just don't just come. We come to play hard, and they do a nice job. What's next for you? What's next for you personally? Maybe the golf course? Well, I see you back at Planet Fitness, I'll, I'll getting back into shape a little bit. I'll be at Planet Fitness. As you can see, I need to work a little harder. But uh, I plan to hit the golf ball a little bit more, wait till my wife retires, and then I'll have, we'll have some travel and so forth. You know what's funny is, you know, Coach and I used to ride the bus together when we coached at Bacon Academy, and I used to love it. I love the bus rides, and I'm sure high school coaches and yourself in general can't stand them, and that's why you came off the sidelines and became an AD. To, to be honest with you, that last year with basketball where I had 20 cheerleaders, 20, 20 basketball players, four or five coaches, and getting home at 10.30, maybe after getting beat on a Tuesday night, that got to be long. All right, coaches still kind of moaning and groaning about all the technical fouls I got to on the sidelines, but Dave, it's been a tremendous run for you. Thank you should be extremely proud of you know, what you've done here in Waterford and go way back to your days of coaching football with Mike Emery. I'm sure you'll have time to reflect that at the end of the year, but this is very yeah. special. You know what? It's very seldom can you come home and, and get to be a, the AD at your own high school where I went back in 74. I guess that was a couple of years ago. And uh, and to be able to finish here was really special for me. All right, good stuff. Dave, listen, Casey, I'm going to see Dave Sue's on the golf course very soon. Mark my words. Congratulations, Dave.